Hello guys, welcome to Teach Me channel. In this video, I want to show you how to configure Jenkins with Prometheus and get the Jenkins status in Grafana and as a graphical mode. Okay, so in earlier videos, I have shown you how to install Prometheus in Grafana. In uh, one server, I have installed Prometheus in Grafana and here i have server 2 where i have installed jenkins and in server 1 the prometheus and grafana is installed okay so now uh, what i will do i will take two servers okay here i have two servers that one server i have installed prometheus and grafana and in jenkins server i have uh, docker but I am not showing doc uh, I am not uh, utilizing docker here I will show only Jenkins okay how to configure Jenkins to Prometheus okay first start the server I have started the server it is in running condition get the IP public IP and go to browser 8080 my Jenkins is running in port number 8080 I have given Jenkins username and password okay sorry Jenkins and then password yeah so another one server I have installed is Prometheus so get the IP and I have opened that in my mobile extern okay First login to the is it instance this is a server from AWS here I already have downloaded the Prometheus okay and I have installed Grafana using the RPM okay these things I already have shown you in the previous videos and I will give the description uh, the link in my descriptions okay so now go to the Prometheus here as you know there is a Prometheus.yml Prometheus.yml so here what we have to do we have to mention the job name so job name it can give anything like Jenkins or any name we can give so matrix part okay before doing that I will do one more thing in Jenkins go to the Jenkins okay go to manage Jenkins and manage plugin go to available Type Prometheus all the available plugins will be here okay so Prometheus matrix you can see just click and install without restart let's see so this plugin we require so then only we can get the Prometheus uh, the status in our Prometheus okay to configure Jenkins this is this plugin is important okay so uh, what it is saying that Prometheus plugin doesn't support dynamic loading so Jenkins need to be restarted for the update to take effect okay so I'll have to restart the Jenkins I will restart from the browser we can restart it from the browser yes so Jenkins will be restarted and the plugin will be installed. Let's do one thing. My Prometheus is already running. So first Okay, sorry. Yeah, 
so i will have to kill this process okay kill hyphen nine from yes you give the pid one four seven three okay sick okay now it is not running clear okay let me go to the jenkins yeah jenkins is restarted okay jenkins username and password and i think the plugins should be installed now let me go to the plugins minus plugins installed Prometheus. So, yeah, this Prometheus Matrix plugin is installed. Okay, now what I will do go to the Jenkins and go to manage Jenkins and configure system. Okay, so after installing the plugin, what we will get, we will get one new option here. You can see here Prometheus. Okay. So part is Prometheus, by default it is coming, default namespace is default, enable authentication from Prometheus endpoint. If we we'll click this, we will have to authenticate Prometheus uh, with Jenkins. I am not selecting this one now. And okay. Apply and now go to the Prometheus. Here, Prometheus.yml. Okay here i already have given the jenkins url just ip and the port number after installation of this plugin what we will get if we we get one endpoint if we i promise yes we will get the state uh, status of the jenkins okay this matrices we got from the jenkins prometheus plugin okay so if we type jenkins url and port and then prometheus this prometheus we are getting from that default part we have mentioned there in here here as you have mentioned this part so that that's why we are getting the <coughs> matrices in the url okay now go to the prometheus and give the ip so ip could be the ip address from here i am copying okay so i think the ip address is already okay it's fine that's the new Okay, paste it here and then port number is 8080 and uh, what we were getting we were getting after slash prometheus okay that slash prometheus it, we will have to mention here matrix part okay and save it now now start prometheus dot slash prometheus okay okay so prometheus is started now go to the browser get the ip of prometheus and prometheus runs at port 1990 okay so yeah we are getting the prometheus uh, dashboard here you can see we are getting some matrices okay go to the status and targets you can see we are getting the Jenkins IP and port number and a part as endpoint and it is now up in status is up now okay if I right click or open that in new tab we will get the matrices okay this is the Jenkins matrices we are getting while we are um, giving the Jenkins IP and port number and slash Prometheus okay the same we are getting here also okay now what i will have to do now the next thing is to start the 
Grafana. Let's see. Grafana is start or not. Okay. This time CPL status Grafana. Grafana Salva. Okay. Okay. So my Grafana Salva is up and running. I will restart it. Okay. Start and status is stop now and then start it. Okay. No safety status. Okay, it is up and running. Now go to the dashboard. Get the IP address same because I have installed Grafana and Prometheus in the same server and go to the browser give the port number 3000 as, as Grafana runs at port number 3000 okay so we are getting this okay now what I will do I will import a Jenkins dashboard from the Grafana dashboard we have these are the dashboards I have if you search for a dashboard Jenkins okay like Jenkins and we are getting this uh, okay so this one is the dashboard we can use this is downloaded by 5172 and this data source here it is mentioning this Prometheus here it is also Prometheus His, this data source is in FluxDB so we cannot use this one because we are using Prometheus we'll have to use this dashboard or graphite we cannot use Prometheus this we can use and now let me try this one Okay. Here you will get one ID, this is 306. Go to the Grafana, paste it here, and load. Okay. Okay. So, performance. Just give performance. Okay. Then select Prometheus data source. Now import. You will get this type of data Jenkins hail Jenkins plugin fail like that we will get okay I will try another one we can create our own dashboard also so here in this 9964 okay go to here create and import okay paste it here and then load this two okay now Prometheus and import you will get this type of Jenkins uh, dashboard in Grafana so we can monitor our Jenkins uh, server from Grafana using uh, Prometheus Okay, so that's all for this video. I wanted to show this, and uh, if you like the videos, please do subscribe and share and comment. Okay, do like and press the bell icon. Okay, thanks.